Walmart in Lee's Summit has disappeared. That is from Jackson County's own records. If you go to the county's website and click on that property, no information is available. And this didn't surprise investigative reporter Angie Rocono, who questioned the county about the value of that Walmart. She joins us now live from the newsroom. So Angie, what did you find? Well, we found that that Walmart was valued at the same price as many homes in Lee Summit. And of course, it's not supposed to work that way. So we discovered this Whopper when we simply reviewed the values of 2018 and compared them to the values of 2019, which were recently finalized. And here's what happened. The value of that Walmart, which was more than $13 million, is now $350,000. That's right, $350,000 and some change for a super Walmart. It comes with a giant lot and plenty of parking. We emailed the county about this yesterday and today, guess what? That Walmart has no public information or property report. It's all been stripped off. And if you click on it, it just simply says no information available. Now we're not trying to be picky, but we are trying to hold the county accountable for an assessment that they say is fair and accurate. But some homeowners disagree. So we continue to investigate. We have a huge brand new investigation online that was just posted. It's the five things you need to know about this assessment. We have the latest data that our I team crunched with the help of data expert Preston Smith. So we are using the county's own information and comparing the cleaned up values from this assessment to last year. The county acknowledges they have received my email. They are looking into my question about Walmart, which you can no longer see, but you can see it on our website. Angie Ricono, KCTV5 News. Angie, thanks. Keep up the good work.